Welcome back to the Community Resource Minute. I'm Todd Blanton, one-stop operator for the Kentucky Career Centers here in the Bluegrass. On today's edition, we have with us Brian Lerman of Code Kentucky. So welcome, Brian. Thanks, Todd. Good to be here. So today, Brian, I understand you're going to talk to us about um, an upcoming opportunity with Code Kentucky. You've got some classes that are starting in January. So uh, if you would give the viewers a little bit of information, what is Code Kentucky? And then I'll let you expand into uh, what you guys have going on in January and how folks can get involved. Yeah, so uh, Code Kentucky is a uh, completely free program for those that are interested in exploring what a career in software development will look like. So when we say software development, we're talking uh, programming, app development, you know, web development, things of that nature, uh, data analytics. And um, our next class is beginning in early January. Um, but to participate in that class, we're asking people to sign up now because we have a, an enrollment process and a pre-work uh, assessment that we have everyone go through. And so um, you would just uh, sign up for that, uh, uh, go to our website and sign up at codekentucky.org and there'll be an application there and everything and fill that out and then we'll be in touch soon. But basically, uh, once you get in that class, we'll um, show you what it means to be a software developer, uh, give you a lot of exposure to that career, and then uh, you'll pick a pathway, a specialization uh, in software development that you'll go through. Uh, we'll help you make that decision, of course, and then throughout that process, we'll help you with things like writing your resume, looking for uh, jobs in the field, uh, and uh, connecting with employers, and developing your portfolio of projects. So Brian, one question, if, if somebody out there is interested, but they don't have the technology or are there technology requirements, can you talk to us just a little bit about uh, what kind of requirements as far as technology goes and if someone doesn't have that readily available right now when they're signing up, what they need to do? Yeah, sure. So uh, first of all, just the requirements to participate in general uh, are you just have to be 18 or older, resident of one of uh, the Bluegrass area's uh, counties and uh, have a passion and an interest in learning technology. So um, you have to be interested in it. You don't have to be a computer whiz, but uh, you have to be interested in and comfortable with computers. Uh, but as far as the technical requirements, um, you do need a laptop or a home computer or something to participate uh, in the program, but we have resources to help you with that. Um, so if you don't immediately have a laptop, reach out to us um, and we can connect you with somebody who uh, will be able to help you find a laptop while you're participating in the program. Awesome. Well, that sounds great, Brian. So um, looks like you said the deadline was October 23rd. So if anybody out there is, is watching, they need to go ahead and sign up at CodeKentucky.org to get the process started uh, to get those classes in January. Yep, that's correct. Um, so just get signed up soon and, uh, and we'll be in touch. Uh, we're trying to get everyone signed up by October 23rd so we can reach out to them in the first week of November. All right. Thanks, Brian. Well, you heard it here first on the Community Resource Minute. Another great opportunity with Cold Kentucky starting in January. The deadline to get in is October 23rd. So if you're interested, please visit CodeKentucky.org to get signed up. Brian, we appreciate you coming on today. Yeah, thanks for having me. All right, great. And tune in to next time's edition of the Community Resource Minute. I'm Todd Blanton, one-stop operator at the Kentucky Career Centers here in the Bluegrass. Thanks for watching.